Bat should clear most of this. Oh, red bop. Is it going for the bats? Is it? Is it going for the bats? Oh, oh, he's on a mission. Oh, he's chasing them, dude. <laughs> that red bob going across the map. He really wants those bats. Oh my gosh. We're back with the next OP matchup in the IPCL playoffs. This is going to be a best of two. And we got Queen Walkers versus Repotted Gaming in two back-to-back -back matches where we're going to add up the scores of both matches to see who's going to win and move on to the next round. This is match number one in the best of two. We got Stadra coming in with the first attack for Queen Walkers with a little wee-wee action. What in the invisible owl is going on? Did you guys see that? I think he had an invisible owl and he died. Rip. Warden gonna be able to step up. Snipe a few buildings here. Okie dokie. He's gonna go for the cannon. I think we're trying to funnel the expo at least. He's gonna enter from the eagle artillery. I bet he is. Warden gonna take out the expo and the cannon. Do we need the rage? He's gonna go with the rage just to be safe. Might not have needed it. I'm not sure. There goes the wall break to get him access to the eagle artillery. We should be able to start with the wee wee any second now. Here we go with the witches on the right. Pekka to pull the Grand Warden. He can go on the outside. He might go inside. Not sure yet. There goes the log launcher to get us all the way through the base. King's going to go outside. Okay, good. That's probably what he wanted. Wee Wee is in behind the Pekkas. Some Coco Loons to search for sticking air mines as well. Log launcher is going to beat through the walls. Sure, sure, sure. Looking decent. Wall break on the south side with the baby dragon to funnel. We want the king to go in for the scatter. Probably going to use the royal champion to help assist him. Logs beat through the wall on the top side. Hopefully the P.E.K.K.A.s all reroute perfectly. No, they're going to go beat on a wall. Oh, he dropped the log launcher too high. Uh-oh. Oh, they go back. They heard me. LOL. We get through the multi. We get through the queen. King and road champion on the south side. Are they going to pull the CC troops or are the P.E.K.K.A.s going to pull them? Oh, the hound goes bot down. That's actually not good because the road champion is going to get stuck on it. And we need to get through that single target in front of tower quicker than quick. We get through the scatter shot. We lose most of the super wizards. No, I just didn't see them. There they are. Yetis from the log launcher are going to help out. Healer switch. This is looking decent. We are going to use the invisibility spell there to keep everybody alive. RC is getting through all the pups. We're all out of spells. Homie still has the grand warden ability. Yo, what the? I think he just forgot to use it. <laughs> Bro, pop that warden. There he goes. Pops the warden ability. Down goes the town hall. RC is going to get hammered. By that Giga Bomb and the Giga Poison combo. But the Queen and the Warden are still alive. Without any spells, though, there's still a lot of defenses over there on the top side of the base to get through. Need the healers to get onto the Queen, please. Oh, rip those healers. Red Bomb galore behind that Town Hall. Got the Queen with the Unicorn, two Pekkas, and the Grand Warden. One healer still alive. Is it going to be enough to get through all this? We've only got 18 seconds. Oh, rip. Stodger's wee wee. That back end wall breaker was kind of clutch. Tell me he can get it. Oh, I think he's going to run out of time. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Rip the time fail from Stodra. 2, 1, and we fall short at 98%. Repotted Gaming are in with their first attack, bringing us some Lalo action. We got the queen over at 130. Wizard at 3 o'clock. We're going to wall break in at 2 o'clock. Got an ice golem to help out. <coughs> Couple balloons for the archer tower at 3. Okie dokie. Ice golem should go in, but he's going the wrong way. The yeah, ice golem didn't get that much value. King on the top side. Hello, Tesla farm. Queen should get the town hall. King with the road champion. We find the tornado trap. Tesla farm. Lots of skellies. <sighs> Ooh, the suey was baited. He's going to go with the freeze. Queen pops her ability. Does she get the town hall? Oh, yes. We had to use the invis to redirect her attention to the town hall. Nicely done with the invis. Down goes the town hall. RC gets the scatter. Not going to get the hound. Hound stays alive. That's actually pretty decent, though. We can just leave it alive. We got a lightning spell, but he didn't even use it. Start with the stone slammer here on the top side of the base. Lalo coming in from the left toward the eagle artillery right away. Warden on air with the little owl that could to support. Okie dokie. We're going to have to go through a sweeper, which is a little annoying. We're going to rage through the eagle right away. Hound on the bottom side of the base. A couple balloons in behind. It's not an easy law, though, as he's not getting a whole lot of pathing to that core multi. We do have a dragon rider from the stone slammer. Pop the warden ability here on the left with the headhunters to kill the enemy archer queen. Balloons to take out the multi, but hello, red bombs. Good thing he had a dragon rider there to help support. 
Rage of the South Side. Does he have a Skelly spell? No. Oh, he doesn't need it. Headhunters did kill the enemy queen. It's looking decent, actually. We don't have any more freezes. I mean, we don't have any more haste, but we have several freezes. We're going to keep that Dragon Rider alive. Hound is eventually going to pop. A good thing he saved the poison spell to help deal with it. The lightning spell to re or reset the targeting of the single. Bro, that was pretty clutch. I like that. Dragon Rider is probably going to die to the air skellies being annoying as heck as our owl is stuck on the king. We pull the hound over to the left with an archer. He's going to get through all the defenses. The Dragon Rider dies. Finally, the owl is going to start helping with the air skellies. Poison spell to help get through the pups. And it's all about cleanup time. And I think he gets it. Plenty of time. 40 seconds to go. Poison killed almost all the pups. Beautifully done here from Repotted Gaming to kick things off in this match. And they are going to have an advantage over Queen Walkers after the first round of attacks. They are going to be up three stars to two. As we fly over, take out the DE storage. Beautiful. Sui Lalo right there. What's up, everybody? I'm now partnered with Soundstripe for some OP new music here on the channel. If you want to check them out, link in the description. Use code LEXNOS to get 15% off. Gaku is in with the second attack for Queen Walkers, bringing us some LOL Rider action. Gonna start with the Queen on the top side of the base. We're delaying the healer drop. Nope, gonna drop those healers right away. She might go inside. This pathing could be a little wonky, you never know, with those open walls. Oh, excuse me. Queen gets the wizard tower, she's gonna step to the right for now. So there goes the rage, we're gonna wall break in toward the archer tower, okay. He is gonna wall break her in toward the town hall, sure. Lots of archers in the CC, what else is gonna be in there? Rocket loons, Woo! do we need the freeze? I think he does. Nope, okay, Woo! good call from Gaku. Doesn't need the freeze, he just goes with the second rage. Balloon and Baby Dragon to get the Tesla. Queen cannot reach the multi. He wants the Town Hall, nice Coco Loon. Queen steps up to fight the enemy Queen. The rage spell still in effect, nice. Ooh. The Queen goes out and to the right. Yo, what the? That was not part of the plan. Uh-oh, Gaku's in trouble. Can we get the Queen to go in for the multi, please? Queen, where's your freeze? Sir, you got four freezes! And you're not gonna use them to save your healers. Oh, no. Rip, Gaku. It's getting real spicy now. Queen goes back inside. She's gonna get the multi. We're gonna wake up the town hall with a sneaky. Oh my gosh, he doesn't even get it waking, woken up. Rip. Dragon Riders from the south. We could send the king for the town hall at least. But man, this is getting messy. King will take out the Town Hall. Dragon Riders and a Stone Slammer. I mean, it's still possible? Can he get this three star? Maybe. We're gonna send the Slammer to the core. Dragon Riders go to the core anyway, though. Headhunters go for the King and not the Queen. That's a little awkward. He's got a lot of freezes, bro. Freeze a single, freeze a single. No, maybe not. Okay, he is. King will take out the Town Hall. He wasted a freeze up there. Oh, he needed it. The king must have got stalled up on a skelly trap or something. Single stays up. Rip. This is looking real wonky. There goes the rage. For the balloons? Oh no, Gaku. Should have saved the rage and the freeze for the dragon riders. I think that's a waste of spells. Rip. Dragon riders all move up toward the north. Only 30 seconds to go. The minions get through the inferno tower. LOL. Down goes the air defense. And this is going to fall short. This is a massive defense for Repotted Gaming, dude. If they get another three star, they're going to have a huge lead in this match. How much percent can we get here? The Owl trying his best to grab the Collector. Dragon Rider will go down. Warden can grab the Archer Tower. And we're going to run out of time here at 78. Yes, 78% for Gaku. Timtastic is in with the next attack. If he gets a triple here, Repotted Gaming will have a massive lead over Queen Walkers. Why does this base look familiar? I think we saw it in a match earlier today. Yeah, we did. Let's see what Tim Tastic's going to be able to do here with his Lalo, though. Five invisibility, so he's going to go for a Blizz. Hound and Blimp on the top side. Ooh, tell me he's got a wall breaker in this Blimp. I want to see it. I think he's going to have a wall breaker. Ooh, it lands right there in the dead zone. <gasps> the tornado 
bro! How perfect! Is it baited? But there's no giant bombs. Rip. Okay! The blizz is gonna work. Tell me they go up for the scatter, please. Yeah, scatter drops. Can they get the royal champion as well? They do. Royal champion dies. Do we get the expo? Ooh, yes! Do we get the cannon? No, not quite, but that's okay. Probably gonna sue you for that. That's some good blizz value. How about that? Balloon over at 11 o'clock. Sneaky goblin as well. We're gonna pull the hound over toward 10 o'clock. Queen to kill it. We were gonna want the queen to take out the town hall. There goes the wall breaker. Sneaky to funnel the bottom side. We got an ice golem still to utilize. King and royal champion. King's gonna go with the queen. Sure, sure, sure. We'll take out the town hall. I think the queen could have gotten it by herself though. Oh well. King to pop his ability. Take out the town hall. Who got locked onto by the inferno? The ice golem did. King pops his ability. Is queen gonna skip that archer tower? Nope, she goes up for the archer tower then back down. Okay, she's gonna step inside the giga poison though. She's gonna take a lot of damage from that. So got the road champion to use. Where are we gonna start the Lalo? He goes with the RC first from the 730 side of the base. Queen can pop her ability to take out the single. There is a queen ability. RC is in, but she's probably gonna skip this multi. Okay, here we go. How are we gonna get that multi? I'm not sure. Warden with the Lalo over here. We already send a hound to that second air defense. This is gonna get a little wonky. Tesla's gonna distract this Royal Champion. Gonna send Headhunters for the Queen. Pop this RC ability. I mean, pop the Warden ability. <clears throat> That's gonna force RC to the multi. All right, I like it. Loons on the right are taking a beating from the scatter. We're gonna have to freeze it up. Haste our way in. Down it goes. We still got another two freezes of haste. An invis. Bro, this is wrecked. Right? Unless there's a bunch of red bombs to stop him. This is absolutely destroyed. There goes another freeze for the top side. Our road champion died. We're going to swag an invis. Last freeze is in for the wizard tower. This is destroyed. Holy heck. What a Timtastic attack from Timtastic. Wow. 30 seconds for cleanup. A beautiful Blizz Lalo against Dodger's base. Makes the queen invisible so she survives. Kills the king. 20 seconds to spare and repotted gaming with a massive lead against queen walkers now six stars to four stars is in with the third attack bringing us some blizz maybe not a blizz but he's got a hound dragon riders with bats 12 sneakies maybe for the town hall what is his plan got two ice golems for a big suey push okay Let's see what stars can do. Is he actually going to use a hound for a yeti bomb? This man's is wild. Gonna wall break. I think we are doing sneakies for the town hall. He is doing a hound for a yeti bomb. Is that really needed? Is it just for the scatter? It is. I don't know if a whole hound was needed to tank for that. He must have been scared of a tesla farm out here or something. The Yeti Bomb is successful though, absolutely demolishes that queen, gets the CC pool nice and early as well. Okie dokie. What's next? Pulls the Hound to 9 o'clock. Oof, those archers are getting wrecked. Bro, you can't do it! The archer tower is there! Oh my. Drops the archer queen. She's gonna take out the archer tower, then lock onto the headhunter, then lock onto the Hound. Okay, wizard tower is gonna be on her, but that's okay, we got the unicorn. To keep her alive. Sure. Poison spell to help with the pups. Okie dokie. He wants the queen to walk up toward the multi, I think. Here we go with the sneakies for the town hall with the invis. Down the town hall it goes. Perfectly done with the sneakies. King to walk down and in toward the scatter. Sure. Wall break the top side for the queen to go in for the multi. Sure. King will go in. Ice Golem to help support. Baby Dragon to make sure the funnel is set. Where's the Road Champion going to go? Queen's going to have to go to ability. Down goes the cannon and the multi. We're not using the RC. We're going to save her for helping the Dragon Riders, I guess? He's using a lot of time to do this, Sui. Like, a lot, a lot of time. Here we go with the Dragon Riders from the south side of the base, finally. Warden on air to support. Little Owl that could in there as well. Air Defense does a lot of damage to the first Dragon Rider. We only got five of them, remember. He does have Bat Spells. Seven of them, in fact. Still the Royal Champion to hopefully get some splash. He's going to go with the Bat Bomb in the middle of the base on the multi. Nice and early. Second freeze is in. Down goes the multi. 
RC from the right side to grab the wizard tower. There's not a whole lot of splash left. All there is is that wizard tower on the top side of the base. Bats should clear most of this. Oh, red bop. Is it going for the bats? Is it? Is it going for the bats? Oh, oh, he's on a mission. Oh, he's chasing them, dude. <laughs> that red bob going across the map. He really wants those bats. Oh my gosh. But then he explodes. Rip. Bats are going to die to the wizard tower. No, they're still alive. RC is going to get stuck here on the king. We got a Tesla farm to worry about. Only 30 seconds for cleanup. RC gets stuck on the king and we don't have a headhunter. Just go ahead and pop her ability, dude. Take out the Tesla farm. Save the dragon rider, please. 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 Oh, no. It's a fail. Oh, stars. I thought he had it. Rip. It's a third fail in a row for Queen Walkers. They are struggling against Repotted Gaming's bases. Hello, Red Bomb. And we're going to fall short at 94%. 95%. Repotted Gaming coming in with their third attack, bringing us some Queen Charge. LOL Rider action with an early battle blimp, likely a Yeti Bomb. Yep. Take out the scatter shot right away. Splash damage of the blimp took out three Teslas on top of that. That's some nice bonus value from the Yeti Bomb. We're going to be able to get rid of all five Teslas right away. Solid start here to this attack. Yeti Bomb creates a nice funnel. Only thing it didn't do is get a CC pool, but that's okay. Looks like he's going to try to get Queen to naturally walk inside here for the multi. He's going to need a good funnel to make sure it happens. We're going to use a Yeti and a Wizard to get that funnel. Ooh, Rage the Queen. She almost had to go to ability there. Wall Breaker is not going to do what he was anticipating, I think. Tell me Queen goes back inside. Yes, she does. Perfect pathing. We're going to use another Coca Loon? No. Are we going to freeze or rage? He's going to go with the next rage. Yeti coming back around to target the Queen. Nope. He changes his mind again. Going for the air defense. Okie dokie. Here come the CC troops. Pretty classic. Lava Dog and the double headhunter. Yeti might take out the air defense. Poison spell to get rid of the headhunters. Coca Loon out in front. Searching for seeking air mines. That Coca Loon pulls the tornado. Okay. That's pretty nice. Queen never going to have to trigger it. We're going to send the king in toward the Eagle Artillery. So I got the five Dragon Riders to utilize. He doesn't have any wall breakers, but he does have a jump spell likely to get all the way toward the Town Hall. We send the RC straight in for the king. Got a headhunter to support, but hello giant bombs. Goodbye headhunter. Jump spell for the queen, but we need another rage. There it is. Ooh, healers. We're going to have to freeze to keep her alive. Dragon Riders on the south side of the base. RC is going to be responsible for going to the core, I think. But she's not pathing there. Rip. Rip the pathing. That core multi is going to stay up. Queen will get the town hall. But the core multi is not going to go down. Uh-oh. King's going to be beaten on walls. we got a freeze and an invis. We're going to freeze the single. Queen will get the town hall. Got an invis. <sighs> Might need to save it for the royal champion later. Pop the queen ability just to make sure the town hall goes down nice and early so the royal champion doesn't get hit by the Giga Bomb. RC is going to die. It's going to be up to these Dragon Riders to go take out the multi. 40 seconds to go. Queen is still alive. He uses the invis early. Why? Why? She still dies to the poison anyway. I think that was a mistake. But I think he still gets it at the same time. 26 seconds to go. Queen gets the buildings on the right. Dragon Riders. Hello, Air Skellies. But the Dragon Riders are healthy. Hello, Red Bombs. Hello, Seeking Air Mines. But one Dragon Rider will stay alive. Down goes the multi. Down goes the gold storage. It's another triple for Repotted Gaming. Wow. The lead is just stacking up. And the score is currently six stars to nine. Pog. The man, the myth, the legend. Klaus himself is in with some Queen Charge Rider action with five rocket balloons and a super barbarian. Okay. Rocket loon to get the Tesla and it works. Queen over here on the two o'clock side of the base. Looks like we want her to walk up and skip the town hall. Probably. There goes a Coco Loon out in front. Gonna drop the healers any second now. Healers on the queen. We do indeed just want her to skip the town hall and she should. She might go inside this interesting wall gap. I feel like she will. Are we gonna try to send King for the multi or anybody for the multi? Somebody for the multi? Maybe, potentially, possibly. Rocket loons for the archer tower. What about the multi, sir? Bro, she's going up. She's going down. I thought she was going up, but hello, Invis. Hello, CC troops. 
Multi on the queen. Got to freeze. Ooh! Rip the ability. What about the multi, sir? Thank you. The rocket loons were a little late. Freeze again. Does that take out the multi? Poison to help the queen. We're going to use an archer. Okie dokie. This is looking very sketchy. Next rage on the queen. We already popped her ability. We got only two freezes to keep her alive. Ooh! Ooh! King for the town hall, but that's going to cost us a freeze. Oh! Queen! Oh. Bro, Queen Walkers are struggling today. Holy heck. Is King even going to path to that town hall? He's going to go for it last. Eagle shooting the King. We need to send the Dragon Riders to hopefully take some damage off the King. Oh my gosh. King's got his ability, but he's getting hammered by the Eagle. It might cost us the last freeze just to make sure this town hall goes down. No, he gets it. Down it goes. Stone Slammer from 12 o'clock. King clears the right side compartment. Dragon Riders from the 1030 section of the base. Okie dokie. Royal Champion in to help out. Early as heck war and ability. Stone Slammer's going to go down right away. Headhunters go for the king and not the queen. We're going to rage up on the right. Need this Royal Champion and the Headhunters to kill that enemy queen, please. And they do. Dragon Riders on the left will take out the eagle. Dragon Riders on the right going to path to all the Inferno Towers. We still got a Royal Champion to worry about. There goes the last rage. Gonna have to freeze the single. And he does. Bro, look how much of a push he still gets. Still has the RC ability. Boom, boom, boom. Down goes the single. Bro, this almost could have pulled through. <laughs> wow. Even though the queen charge got like no value. Dragon Riders are gonna slowly start dying off though to the scatter shot in the air defense. I don't think it's a time fail. I think it is a fail fail. Yeah, it is. Hello, Tornado Trap. Rip Klaus. Nice try. But we're going to fall short here. How much percent can he get? 77 maybe? Nope. Going to fall short at 76 percent. Oof. Mech is in with the next attack. Can he keep up the triple train for Repotted Gaming? He's going in with some LOL Rider action with a jump spell. Okie dokie. We need to walk up from 9 o'clock in toward 10. Which way do we want to jump? Got another wall break on the top side, maybe for the king to go take out the eagle. Okie dokie. Aggressive rage on the queen. Next wall break to get her in toward the scatter shot. Nice. Very nice. Queen's gonna kill the enemy royal champion inside that first rage spell. Looking decent so far. King's gonna go in for the eagle. There's gonna be a whole Tesla farm there. Might need the royal champion to help assist him, or the eagle might not go down. Pops that king ability. <clears throat> rage the queen up again. She's going to go down for the scatter. King's going to get distracted by the enemy king. Does he take out the eagle? Ooh, yes, he does. That's OP. Queen gets a scatter shot. Poison spell to help her fight the enemy CC troops. The multi stays alive, but at least uh, king got the eagle. That's actually super important. Queen going to be able to fight the lava dog. We drop a minion to help support. Next rage for the queen is in. She won't be able to reach that multi, but as long as the healers don't get inside that multi range, we're going to be looking good. Lose a healer to a seeking air mine there. Jump spell to get Queen to go charge the Town Hall on the single. Okie dokie. And we start the Dragon Riders from the top side of the base. Hello, Red Bombs. That's a lot of Red Bombs. Good thing Red Bombs don't really do much to Dragon Riders. Healers just barely staying outside the range of the multi. There's a lot of Air Skellies. We're going to send some Headhunters. RC's going to get stuck on these Air Skellies for quite a while. Ooh, that freeze was late. Rip the Queen's ability. She should still be able to get the Town Hall, though gonna path to it perfectly Can we get the headhunters to take out this queen please no bro she's already killed like two dragon riders rc still stuck on air skellies rc's gonna go fight the enemy queen now do we have a freeze to help keep her alive owl's helping out Woo! it's looking sketchy queen barely gets the town hall we got one freeze in the bag two dragon riders on the right royal champion in the middle queen goes down and healers switch to the royal champion but we already used her ability gonna need to use the freeze to keep her alive freeze freeze there we go. Royal Champion stays alive. Two Dragon Riders still alive. Can he get the triple? Healers trying their best to get the Royal Champion back up to full health. I think he's got it. Minions on the top side. Dragon Riders cruising through the bottom side of the base. Time shouldn't be an issue. 25 seconds. Come on. Can he do it? Minions on the right. Dragon Riders and Royal Champion on the bottom side. 17 seconds to go. He's got it. That's going to be a fourth three-star for Repotted Gaming. They are just demolishing 
the Queen Walker's bases at the moment. Wow, impressive stuff from them. Yuta 14 is in with the final attack for Queen Walkers. Coming in with a little Lalo action. Two invisibilities, no healers. I don't think it's going to be a Blizz, just a good old school Sui Lalo here. Minion to funnel at 9 o'clock, sure. Queen with a giant over at 8. Gonna try to Sui the town hall. Okie dokie. There goes the wall breaker to get Queen in toward the town hall chamber. Sneaky on the south side. Another wall breaker over here for the 6 o'clock compartment. Queen with the ice golem gonna go in. Take out the town hall. Skelly Trap gonna stall her up for a few seconds. King's in for the scatter shot. We still got the royal champion to utilize. Ice golem in to help the king. Sure. Queen will go in. We can pop her ability. King still has that ability. He's going to go with the freeze first instead of the king ability. Interesting. Can Queen get the single? She goes for the Tesla instead. King's going to pop his ability at the last second. Royal Champion in to help assist. Sure. Down goes the scatter shot. Ice Golem still hasn't popped. That Ice Golem unfortunately didn't get that much value. Ooh, it might help now for the Royal Champion. There goes the poison spell to take out the Headhunters. RC, we got a lot of invis to help her get the eagle. Still got her ability. Next invis is in. Pulls the hound over to 6 o'clock. Perfect. So RC can not get distracted by it. Pop the RC ability. She gets the sweeper. Can she get the expo? No, she switches. Right. That's okay. Lalo coming in from the left side of the base. Here we go. It's going to be a big Lalo with a lot of spells. 90 seconds to get it done. Stone Slammer's in. Next hound is in. We're going to freeze up the scatter on the top side, rage our way through. Queen's going to hop the wall. We got headhunters to help support. We go with the skeleton spell as well. We pop this warren ability. Yes. As we make our way to the core, loons are invincible, looking decent. We got a dragon rider from the stone slammer as well. Warden goes with the dragon rider group. Okay. The rest of the balloons over here. We got a freeze and a haste. Bro, this is so crushed. U to 14. He's been doing good with the Sui Lalos lately. Holy heck. He's going to be able to swag two spells. This base is absolutely smashed. Finally, a three star in this matchup from Queen Walkers. Whew. They are going to have to do really, really well in match number two to have a chance to win this best of two. These repotted gaming are just smashing their bases. <clears throat> this one is going to be a three star and Queen Walkers desperately need a defense i know they can no longer win match number one here but they need a defense to at least give them a, f a fighting chance in match number two we'll see what repotted gaming is going to be able to do with their final attack general x with the final attack of the match can they get the perfect war against queen walkers going in with a little inferno skybird action with a clone spell okay I'm gonna start with some balloons on the south side of the base to funnel a couple of defenses you get the Archer Tower. Two zaps for an Air Sweeper. Is he going to go with an early blimp for the Town Hall? No. We're going to go with the Air Spam from the 430 side of the base. Blimp the Town Hall. Queen to walk from 3 to 12. Going to drop the King a little bit later. There he goes. Air Spam is in. Battle Blimp as well. Skeleton Spells to distract. Hello Teslas. Hello Archers in the CC. We're going to get through the enemy Archer Queen very quickly. Uh, his Queen's going the wrong way. Rip. She's going to beat on a wall. Rage, clone, we get through the town hall. Okie dokie. Gonna start getting through the core. We got a heal spell to help. No, we don't. Inferno Baby's gonna path through the Giga Poison. They get wrecked. We got a free spell to help out. Queen just beating through a wall, being an absolute goofy goober. Wall break on the top side to get the king in toward the Eagle Artillery. Gonna have to keep freezing to keep some of these baby dragons alive. Royal Champions in from the 130 side of the base. She should path to that core scatter. Yes. Okay, that's gonna help out. We freeze and poison on the back end for the Royal Champion, but we lose all the Inferno Babies. Yikers. I think this is going to be a huge defense for Uta 14, bro. Uta 14 with the triple and the defense. Straight up carrying Queen Walkers in this match. We got two freezes. How much percent can this Royal Champion get? Percent still could be really important for them. Queen beats through the wall. We got the Queen ability. We got the RC ability. We got two freezes. Needs to use the freezes, bro. Keep that RC alive. There you go. Queen to fight the enemy of Royal Champion. We pop her ability right away. Freeze the scatter shot right away again. Maybe. Maybe not. Possibly. Potentially. Nope. Okay, that's alright. We'll just freeze later. Bro, don't tell me this could still triple. Hold on. 
Lassie tanking. Tornado Trap says, get over here and grabs that Royal Champion. I feel like this still almost could have tripled. Holy heck. Wow. It actually might. No freaking way. Queen's at full health. Only one cannon to stop her. He's got 50 seconds. Bro, no way. There's a gap in the wall. This is a three star. <laughs> wow. Wow. I am speechless, dude. I cannot believe that still tripled. All of his Inferno Dragons died, like, immediately. And it still triples. It's the perfect war for Repotted Gaming against Queen Walkers. What a match from them. Holy heck. Today is going to be all about them getting the victory. 15 stars to 11. 100% to 89.4.